Hey, what's going on, everyone? Today is um, September the 2nd, 2022. We're going to talk about Cardano. And now that Robinhood has listed Cardano as a tradable asset on their platform, uh, could we possibly see the cryptocurrency ADA go up in price? Well, I'm going to speak to that today on this particular video. So welcome, everyone, to the channel. This is HFN, also known as Chiffin News. I conduct, I produce price prediction without the confusion just to show you all and convince you all that it is very possible and it is a doable thing for you all on your own to predict where prices are going to go as well so if you guys want to join me as we continue to move throughout the cryptocurrency space i will suggest that you do that and you do that by liking the video sharing the video and also subscribing here to my channel now you guys can already tell i got a price prediction on the chart for ada and i'm looking for the market to trend higher So now, considering that this information came out just a couple hours ago yesterday of Robinhood going ahead and listing Cardano on their platform way ahead of the Vasco or the Vassal hard fork, could this possibly be another reason as to why ADA could go up in price? See, from my perspective, from what I see, I don't pay attention to what justifies price movement. I always come through and look at price first and then I try to go in line with what the information is to see if it's actually in line with what the chart is reflecting. So we have the Vassal Hard Fork coming. We have uh, Robinhood listing ADA on their particular platform as a tradable asset. So is the market digesting, dige digesting this information as positive news? Because people will put the money where their mouth is if they feel a certain way about a particular instrument. If people feel positive about it, then they'll come in and buy. If people become nervous, they don't understand, they're fearful about the market collapsing or falling down in this particular asset, then they'll sell it. And currently we can tell since my last video in ADA on August the 30th is that pretty much the market is not too worried about the Vassal Hard Fork or even it being listed, ADA being listed on Robinhood. We're still seeing strength here on the chart is what I'm trying to get you all to see and understand. The market here in ADA is still poised to continue to see higher price move. I like it because even amidst this area right here, okay, on this particular day, August the 26th, 2022, you guys can see how wide that spread bar is. And the volume definitely came into the market in ADA as well on the 26th of April, but the market did not fall. Instead, price in ADA maintained itself around 42 and a half cents. And you guys can see that since then, the market has gone up. So that tells us that there were buyers coming into the market in ADA on the 27th of August. And then again, we saw another indication of selling coming on the 28th of August, but immediately the next day, price in ADA went back up. The chart is not lying to us. We can see that buyers are in this space in ADA, which is why I created the idea that I'm looking for ADA to increase in price that is going to go up. Now, let's take a look at this on a smaller time frame. Uh, this is ADA on the two day chart. And pretty much, we're still seeing instances that this particular currency wants to trend higher. It's still there. Even on this last completed two-day price bar, we started out the last two days as seeing price in ADA go down, but the market successfully closed towards the high of the bar. Looking at ADA here on a three-day. So we're still here. Now, the only issue that I can see from the chart perspective is, okay, how high will ADA go though? So you guys can tell that I'm only topped out in ADA right there around 53, 54 cents. Now, obviously, I told you on the video on August the 30th that 50 cent could also be a point of reject rejection as well. So I want you all to be prepared for that. Like we have to be ready and prepared to take profits. We have to. Let's not get complacent just because we see price moving higher the way they were expected it to go, because there may be moments to where you might get a quick movement back down in price. So, you, yeah, you will have to come in and take the bag. So, all in all, from the two most current events that's to happen in Cardano or ADA, uh, the market currently is not digesting it as negative information, negative news, because the chart is still showing us some bullish signs. Now, you may see some other articles of individuals trying to persuade you that the market in ADA it's going to, to continue to go down or it's going to fall down in price because technical indicators is reflecting that the volume is getting low or, you know, the price of ADA is moving below the 
30 day EMA or the 50 day simple moving average, whatever the case may be. But the price bar, the volume is all indicating something opposite. That's why we have to pay attention to the charts. This is not a hard nor difficult game. Just look at the charts. Look at the money. Price bars and volume represent money. So I'm done. I'm not going to waste too much of your time. I'm going to continue to go forward with what was talked about on August the 30th. So if you all haven't seen that video, it is in my ADA playlist. You guys can go back and listen to that to get an actual gauge as to where my price targets are at. All right, so I'm done. I'm through. Just wanted to come through, give you all a quick update as to what the market is looking like in ADA. And now that Robinhood has listed ADA on their particular platform. I mean, I remember back in the day when certain exchanges were going to list cryptocurrencies. That was a lot of justification as to why people would conduct videos and say market's going to explode or it's going to moon or it's going to rocket up higher. It's going to 10x or 100x just because it got listed on the exchange. Well, in ADA situation is listening on Robinhood and the market really didn't move on the information. See, that's why I don't focus in on news because you come in with some expectations that, OK, well, it happened last time when ADA was listed on, you know, what Binance USA market went up 40 percent off the news. Well, here we are today. ADA is being listed on Robinhood, which is a popular exchange, too. But the market did not even react to it. Don't set your expectations on the news. Your expectations need to be set on the price chart. All right, so I'm done. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.